scratch off the bottom of your shoe. Look at how much these mats eat. It's like it disappears. So there's a trap door there or something. Look at it, up to five pounds of dirt and grime and sand and debris hide themselves in these amazing mats. We call them the clean machine because that's what they're like. They're an unbelievable machine. And let me tell you, before we get to meet Peter, the man who's dumping all that scuzz inside of our rugs, come on over here and I'm gonna show you the different colors that we have. All right, you ready? We'll start you out with jute. I believe, is jute the one that's right here next to me? Because there's two that are similar. Which black, one's this black one? Black Forest. This is, this is Black Forest. All right, ready, Pete? What am I on now? Jute. This is jute. I'm gonna step forward. This? Black Cherry. Black Cherry. I'm going to take a step to the side. Of course, this is evergreen. And you see two because you get two. Ah, flint, I like. So you have a choice of any of these colors. When you buy one, you get two automatically. That's our best value of the day. My good friend Peter Kilcullen is here and he's gonna show you just how these work. We have gotten so many great uh, reviews on this product. It's been a customer pick forever. And virtually all you need to do is walk on it. It has what I call proactive scraping technology. Wow. That's right. That's, That's right. I believe it. PST. It, it, proactive scraping technology. It definitely has that. Because of little fingers that reach out. It, exactly, those, those blades of grass, that AstroTurf. But the cool thing about this mat is you're gonna be able to put a mat outside yes. any door of around your house and it's going to do what a mat was born to do. It's gonna keep all the dirt and grit and sand in the mat and not allow it to get into your house. So you're cleaning more, you're sweeping, you're worried about your hardwood floors, your beautiful tile floors. This is the solution. Keep all that dirt outside of your house and watch what we're able to do. I have our, the black cherry color in front of us. And when you see me pour this sand down into the mat, it really looks like it just disappears. And the reason it's doing that is because those tiny little fingers, they do the job at removing all that dirt and debris from your shoes, but then it falls down in between those blades of AstroTurf, and then it allows you to continue to use that mat. So even with the sand I just put in there, I can still wipe my feet and it works. But we can hold five pounds of sand, so I'm gonna keep going. I want you to see this. Can you imagine what five pounds of sand would look like, you know, in your kitchen, on your floors? but this allows it to all stay in the mat and the mat continues working. Now, for instance, five pounds of sand, that could be weeks and weeks and months. Maybe it's, you know, in a certain days, certainly here in Florida, maybe that five pounds of sand isn't very long, a very long time. But the difference on what these mats can do compared there, to you what you There's a trap door under there. Where's it all going, no, Pete? It's in there. That is it's just, in there, that is guy. insane. It really is I always amazing. think you've got some trick, but it's not. It just loads up. Uh, you got what? How many pounds you got in there? Five pounds of sand. Wow. So you just saw me pouring that all Watch. in there. And look at that. Here's the next best thing about these incredible AstroTurf mats. When we call it a clean machine, it cleans your shoes, but then cleaning out that mat is, it's simple. Shake it out just like that, or even rinsing it out with your hose. Now, guy, you're not gonna believe this. Yeah, yeah. Watch this video. All right. We're gonna speed it up. People going in the house over the course of weeks and months. Look at the mat on the right. That's your, kind of your typical mat. Everyone loves that. It's that cocoa yeah. core. Look at the amount of dirt. Look at this going across the threshold. The, that mat is ruined. It's completely just covered in mud. But look at the clean machine. The AstroTurf collecting all that dirt and debris, not allowing that same amount of dirt to get into the house. And this is showing you a very, very extreme example. But over time, that's what's happening right now if you don't have the AstroTurf mat well, outside your door. And you understand why I say it's proactive because you know normally when you look at like the cork things or the coconut fiber, whatever they are, Pete, right. they're just passive. They stay there. You have to really try to get in there. And because yeah. they're so tightly uh, woven together, there's no way for any of those little uh, those little fingers to get up there and, and scrape the stuff off your feet. Guy, you're exactly so, so right. So with this, it's a little looser and it's that AstroTurf. And by the way, really quickly I should add, it doesn't hurt your feet when you go on it barefoot. So if you are like me and you live near this, the, the beach or whatever, you can scrape that right off your bare feet. It does the same yeah. on your pet's paws. Exactly, that's that super close up of those AstroTurf blades of grass, pulling, scraping, getting that dirt out of there. But then it allows that dirt to settle down to the bottom of the mat. So the surface of the mat, still able to accomplish getting that dirt off your feet, off your sneakers, boots, work boots, anything, the kids' cleats from all their sports, and certainly even the pets, when they're walking across these mats, 
it does a better job trapping the dirt before it gets in the house. And watch, I'm gonna keep going. Each one of these pitchers of sand that I'm pouring into this mat is five pounds. This will hold, now we say five pounds of sand. Guy, I've been able to go well over five pounds of sand. We just have it a is limit amazing that we can talk about, what it can do. Look at that. So look at that. But the great point about this is as I'm pouring all the sand in here, so I'm almost done with this five pounds. I want you to see that. But then it still works perfectly to clean your feet. So I've got a boot right here, guys. Check this out. Yeah. So five pounds of sand in there that you can barely see it in there. But here's that dirty boot, sand. So you're gonna go onto that mat and you're gonna wipe your feet like normal. And the best part is it still yeah. works. It's going to get everything it's off It's like your having feet. a little scrub brush uh, yeah. instead of something flat. And remember, when Pete dumps this out, take a look at look everything at that. that's there. But look now, how easily now, it cleans, and, and Here's guys. the issue too. Now, if I step in sand, like this, right? And I get sand on my shoe. When I come over here and I stand on this, on this mat right here, I mean, you can see there's sand all <laughs> yeah. over it. Well, it doesn't go anywhere. Let's do the same thing in all Watch. these three different options. Let me try to guy. work that in. It's nowhere for it to go. This Coco Core, it's, it's a nice looking mat, and a lot of people have that, but it just, it does not compare with the amount of sand. Guy, how often have you been on, look at it. Here, here's that mat again, guy. If you, if you use that mat one time, Look at that, that's never gonna go away. It's gonna be like that for the whole season. Now you're gonna be searching for a clean area on that map to wipe your feet. But with our clean machine, these AstroTurf mats doing a better job at cleaning your shoes, but then more importantly, you're gonna be able to rinse it out if you need it to. I mean, we're heading into the winter right now, so it's gonna be incredibly dirty. There's gonna be the salt and sand and grit from the roads and the snow, it's gonna be wet. This mat can handle all of it. It's going to keep everything out of your house, but then you can rinse it out, shake it out. It'll be there this season, the season after that. Super durable. It does such a great job. Guys. All right, let me tell everybody again, because they're already, we're getting dangerous on colors if you want. Remember, you get two of these. I can't remind you nothing. Why do we give you two? Most people have an area of their home or a threshold into their home uh, outside of their front door that they want to use this for. Maybe you have a garage uh, door. You put you park your car in your, in your house, right? And then you walk on a cement floor and you know you get that dust and stuff on your shoes. Right before you get in the house, you can scrape it off. And the reason you want to do that is because if you get sand and dirt and grime on your feet, that, those are little crystals. They cut into your hardwood floor. They trash your carpet because they're like little scissors when they get into the carpet fibers. This is going to remove them before you get in. All right. So the one I'm standing on, this is Black Forest. I will step up. This, my friends, is Jute. This is Black Cherry. And you can see how this works. And you can see that active scraping. What do I call it, Pete? Pro PST. PST, proactive, proactive scraping technology. And then I will jump over here. And you, by the way, feel free to use that the rest of the day if you'd like, Pete. Thank you. I, I, it's okay, you can use it. <laughs> All right, so there's that. And then uh, this is flint, which is just basically a dark charcoal. By the way, if you want, you can cut these. So if you needed to put one, a lot of people like will put one on their RV and they just need it in half and they put it just in the little entryway. I saw a guy use, uh, talked about online that he uses it when he brings his kids to the beach. He pulls it out of the trunk. The kids wipe their feet off before, before they get, they in, the get car. in the car. Oh, that, that's, it's that's brilliant. Yeah. You know, I, we use ours in the garage. So I've had one in the garage for a long time and it works so great because our garage steps up into the kitchen. Yes. But guys, just recently, you know my wife, Debbie. Debbie was had a, a beautiful, expensive mat that she had out our back door, but it started to get dirty. It's just not working anymore. I, I convinced her, I brought home the jute color, which she loves, and now we've replaced that out back. It is, it's amazing. They don't get dirty, they don't get stained like those other mats, of, whether it's mud or dirt or who knows what from the dog. We have a puppy at home. It looks great, but it's doing a better job. So even everything that the puppy used to drag in, he's yeah. not dragging in anymore. By the way, and there you can see. Look yeah. how great they look. And, and as I said, great for your pets too, because the little pet paws are gonna are gonna sink down into those little uh, those little uh, fingers, as, as we call them, and they're gonna reach up and get all the scuzz off your pet's feet as well, or, or your cats, whatever you want to. Yeah. Hey, you want a lot of people will put this right out on the other side of a cat box. So the oh, cat's feet yeah, we, will get will brush off when they get out of the we, out of the litter. You're exactly right. We had a lot of calls about using this on the litter box. So I want to show you this. A couple things to show you. Here's that that Coco Core mat again. Well, first of all, right away you're going to see the size difference that we have in here. These are much larger. Actually, you're getting a set of these guys. So one of the great thing is if you put them together as a single mat, they'll work amazing outside those double doors. But let's show you. Let's see what this Coco Core mat can do with over five pounds of sand. 
when I put that on top of it, just shaking out that mat. So look at that, five pounds of sand were in there. I shake it, it looks brand new, it's ready to keep working. And look at this welcome mat not so welcoming anymore when it would be impossible to wipe your feet on that mat again. That's the difference with these AstroTurf mats. They keep working, they keep looking great. Look at Guy. Guy, there it is, look, super close up. This is your uh, PST technology. There it is, right there. But what it really is, is those AstroTurf blades of grass, those fingers grabbing that dirt. It really does scrape your shoes. Yes. So now, but not only just leaving it on the surface, now it's gonna pull it down inside that mat so you keep wiping your All feet right, again Jerry and again. just let me know that we're getting dangerous in a couple colors that they really? could sell out. So, and remember please today that you get two. Normally these are like 20 bucks a piece, okay? We're doing two for $24.95, all right? So, and the reason we do them in a two pack, one is because we want to save you on the shipping and handling so you don't have to pay for them separately. But the other reason is everybody needs two. They always say, I wish I had another one for this part of the house, for that part of the house. And you know, when you when you think about Pete, the amount of money people spend, and I know you, because I know you've uh, you've got your, your Pilates studios and you, your, heart, your floors are very expensive. The last thing you want to do is, is track in a bunch of dirt and sand, because that'll trash it. Like, I, I've been to your it, house. You have beautiful hardwood floors. The hardwood floors. Oh. They're, they're the, they're they'll the ones. kill you if you walk in there with sandy <laughs> feet. She might. Well, honestly, that's one of the biggest things, is not just the, the amount of cleaning that you have to do, but if you can worry about damaging your floors. So right now, look at this. I'm showing you some of this darker dirt, almost like a gravel. Same thing. Actually, this is really close to what a kitty litter might be like, guy. And same thing, it goes into that, into that mat, and you don't have to worry about it going into the that house. It's like volcanic ash that you're putting <laughs> Very in close. There. But the cool thing is, it's still gonna work. So we're pouring all that dirt in there. So now I have a work boot. So if you come home with your work boots, look at that. And you know what, I'm gonna do that again because I want you to hear that. Yeah, you know what that That's, is, right? You know what that is. Uh, yeah, I do. <laughs> That's that scraping technology. But honestly, it's great that you don't even have to think about it, because many of right. us, we're in a hurry. But just walking across that mat in a normal fashion, just getting a couple of steps on that, it's going to do a better well, job at removing the and, dirt and debris on your feet. And, if, and listen, we're, Pete and I are wearing just regular flat shoes, and, and we're showing you boots. If you're wearing heavy-duty boots, yeah. maybe you have a husband or, uh, or a wife or whatever that works in a business where you know their feet get dirty, in the construction business, whatever, this is a great way to be able to clean it up. And you know, we, we, we kind of have a rule in my house, and a lot of people do in Florida, because of all the beaches, and everything, where you leave your shoes kind of on the yeah, out, on the, we, right. you, you can't leave them outside. You scrape them off, but then you take them off and put them in the little entryway. Yeah. This is a way to get rid of that dirt, get rid of that sand. And you know, we just got into fall, so now we're going to have leaves on the ground. We're going to have sure. more stuff that we're going to be stepping in. Uh, and then uh, you know, the snow comes, and then you have the salt. And when you have salt on the bottom of your shoe, everything sticks to it. Exactly. So, Hey, listen. Yeah. We have a. Uh, we are. We got about seven or eight minutes left. We're getting extremely busy. I mean, it's a two for one today. So grab them. Everybody will love these. And by the way, to rinse them off, a hose. All you got to do is so shake easy. them out. Yep. Let's take a listen to one of our good friends, good customers that owns these. And we come back. We'll talk more about how you can get it. Check it out. Okay. I've, we got the AstroTurf. The scraper mats came in. We got two of those. We got them in slate to go along with uh, the decor of the house. It looks great coming in the front door. And we put one at the back door too because we have a pool and a deck back there and with dogs and boys and a lot of traffic coming in from the backyard and from the garden. These are great at really cleaning the shoes and boots and even flip flops off when they come in from outside. Uh, a lot of um, Oklahoma is made of red clay. So we get a lot of that stuff that tracks in the house if you're not careful. And these mats really, really clean the shoes off, clean the the bottoms of the soles off completely. So when you're coming in the house, you're not bringing Oklahoma outside inside. I can't emphasize enough how much it's going to save your That's floors great, yeah. and how I mean, it's just, and I'm, I'm always surprised because some people, people go out and spend $30 on those decorator mats. They don't do anything. Well, they work, you know, for a short time. Yeah, but and they, then you have to replace them. I so know, you're buying them again expensive. and again. And yeah. then if you have, if we're heading into the winter and you're thinking about getting one of those, sadly, just the first rainy, muddy day that you have, that mat's gonna be ruined for the whole season. Yeah. So let me show you real quick. We've kind of we've got some wet sand right here, so I'm hoping I'm gonna get a bunch to stick to my foot right there. I can show you that. Did I get my, oh, oh, come on. Come in on. close. Just Let's get yeah, some squash into there. there, Pete. There we go. I got some on there. No, that's good. You got some on your Let's heel. Let's get some on the front there, too. All right. Good but enough. again, getting onto this mat and just doing like your normal wiping of your feet. Let's, get, let's turn around this way. It does such a good job 
that you can see that it clears that yeah. foot pretty easily. But even just walking across it, it does a great job. And look at that guy, it's hard to see, but I can see this that sand just in this small area. It's not on the surface, but the sand that was on my shoe is down inside that mat. Yeah. So we could do that hundreds and hundreds of more times. And then if we wanted to, then we just shake it out. I wanna show you this, since we're close up here, you can see all those blades of grass, that AstroTurf. They're stiff, they do a great job at scraping the shoes. Not, not skid back, that's gonna allow this to stay in place, but you're gonna be able to rinse this off. It's going to last. That's the best part about this mat. Never gonna get, you know, all, all filled with water and gross and moldy and falling apart. It's gonna look great, it's gonna yep. work. We got five minutes remaining on this. Uh, I'm gonna show you the colors again one more time. Yeah. Start off with Black Forest, and remember, you do get two of these. So uh, the reason we give you two is because like we said, everybody asks for another one. Uh, this is Jute, which is kind of a deep beige sort of a color. Uh, most popular. This is Black Forest, which has sort of a red and black, uh, oh, excuse me, black cherry, uh, which has the red and the black in it. This is Evergreen. Uh, the bases of all these are pretty much the same color. They're all that deep, dark color. Um, and then this, of course, is the Flint, which is just a sort of a blackish gray color. Uh, these are customizable. Again, if you want to cut these, I, I, I didn't mention, I saw tell you about one guy who brings it in the car. He also keeps, uses them as, there's people who use them as car mats. They cut it in half and they put it sort of in the back seat of the car. So when kids go to the beach, they can just take them out and dump them out because regular car mats are just flat and you can and you know you know what's funny is you have car mats in your car and then they'll right. sell you more mats to put over your car mats in your car because they really don't do anything they just allow the sand and the dirt to sit on top that's why your cars always look so dirty no matter how much peter pours into this you'll see Isn't it swallows cool? it up which means you don't have to clean it as often but that honestly you lift it to clean it if you want to wash it put a little soap on there a little nellies or a little crud cutter and just rinse it off oh absolutely rinse it i used a blower on it when it's in the garage you can blow all the dirt out. But that was five pounds of sand. I'm gonna see if I can get a bit more in here of that sand. That was five pounds. Yeah. Imagine what five pounds of dirt would look like on an ordinary mat, or worse than that, inside your house. But I wanna show you, I've got a work boot, guy. Same thing, I've got a work boot show right the boot, there. Pete. Again, you know, these are the kind of things where if you're gonna go in and out of the house, remember, not just your front door, think about every single door in your house, whether it's the back door, the side door, the door from the garage, and of course your front door. Listen to that. That's the hey, scraping. Hey, listen, I would buy these. I don't, have a, I don't have a cat anymore, but I do used to have, my family used to have Siamese cats. And uh, let me tell you, they drag their dirty paws all over the place. They get that stuff everywhere. Put this right in front of the cat box. Definitely. So when the cat walks out, and you know cats, they'll walk on and check it out. They'll get all the scuzz off their feet. Or, you know, if you have your pets that go outside to do their business before they come in, this will, using that technology I talked about, it will actually reach up into their paws and pull out all the little pieces of stuff that, that they drag in. And they don't have to stop and spend extra time. Right. It's going to do a great job because you're seeing it right there those fingers scraping away at the bottom of your, sh your shoes it really is an amazing way I love that we're showing you something right now if you've never tried it it's better than what you're using right now it's gonna solve a huge problem so now look at that what they're doing there, getting all that snow yeah and that's obviously coming, that's all way. gonna be water right but if that was a regular mat even all that water getting that wet that, that mat could be completely ruined, but not with this AstroTurf mat. Again, whether it's water, sand, mud, dirt, you can shake it out, you can rinse it out with the hose, and when you do, look at that, it's a brand new yeah. mat. And that is just amazing. Get, so that's the black cherry color right yeah, there. I love a that lot one, of the guys. customer comments talk about how durable they are, and I think yeah. that's important because, you know, not, not all of us live just in Florida where the, really the worst thing we get is sort of rain. We get hurricanes, but that doesn't affect our doormats too much. But if you live up uh, in anywhere where there's uh, where you get the seasons, anywhere where you get snow or ice or sleet, right. you know how important it is to, to clean off your feet uh, when you come into the house. You know, our parents teach us that when we're kids. But uh, this really lends a helping hand. It's, it really is, and I, I tease about it, but honestly, it's not a passive mat. It really does reach up and take the dirt and the grime and the stuff off your boots and your shoes. Uh, it, it's, it's also the things online, everybody says it's really attractive. It. It, you know, yeah. it's, it, it's, just, it's just a beautiful, a nice color. It's, it's unassuming, it's not this screaming loud thing. I mean, if you want one of those, you can find those at one of those home stores. This is one that really puts cleaning your feet as the number one priority. Yeah, uh, the durability and feet, then the look. It's keeping your house cleaner is 
Astros yes. as well. And I know, you know, my wife Debbie, she was concerned when I said, well, it's an AstroTurf mat. And you, if you think AstroTurf mat, you might not be picturing well, something grass. that this looks is, this right. great yeah. and that really functions this well. So, I mean, so many different colors, they're all gonna match. I mean, my two favorite are definitely that jute because it works so well. I've yeah. got the flint in our garage, but then also I think the evergreen is a perfect one for so many people. It's inviting, right? You have that out front, it looks I great. Like, you know what? Look you, at that. Let's look see at, if you can, you guess which one I would, I would get, Pete? Black Forest. I, I would either, I, that was my second choice. Oh. My first choice, Pete? I'm feeling flint? a little flinty. It's really cool, it's a really nice, there it is, you can see that charcoal yeah, color. Yeah, I yeah, mean, I like we that. have that one in the garage. Again, it looks great, but more importantly, it does such a great job. You are gonna love these mats. All right, God, me, are we getting two mats again? You're getting two for the price of one, That's so I am on flint. If you want if you want the one I'm getting, get the one in flint. I'm, well, it goes with everything, because it's that charcoal gray. This is uh, Black Forest, this black is Forest juice. Black is like a black this and is, tan guy, which I like. This is this black is cherry, black cherry, evergreen. Black cherry, evergreen. I'm sorry. All right, so that so we get two. My for wife one. Debbie is a fan of the jute, that tan Debbie, color, which is know, really nice. She's decorated your house beautifully. Oh so. yeah. All right, Peter, that's about <laughs> it. It's $24.95, and as Pete just said again, you are getting okay, two of these. That. So keep in How mind. That is. We, by the way, there are people online that use them. Uh, you know, if they have a bigger area in the front of the house, they put two. They just put one when next you, to the when other. When you put them together, it looks like a single mat, which yeah, is really like nice. Like a runner. Yeah, absolutely. Perfect. All right, guys, pick it up while you can. Huge customer peek on HSN.com. Thank you, Peter, my friend. Thanks, guy. All right, hey, crud cutter still available if you want to clean these.